What is up YouTube? Okay, so today I'm gonna show you a tutorial of how to set up Sonic Forces on PlayStation and how to complete the first stage of this game. There's like 30, 31 stages all together and I'm, sh and I'm gonna create a series showing how to do all of them. And um, I did say I would daily upload so that's why I'm making this video. So after you've already got the disc in and you get in, you're gonna wanna click X to start. And then as you see over here, it says continue. If you just started, it's not gonna show you this, but if you already have played a little bit, then you got this continue thing. But if you're new, you're gonna wanna click new game. If you already played, you are, you're gonna wanna click continue. But new game, and it says, I'm okay with the other one being deleted. Um, so I'm gonna click okay. But also guys, this recording may pause for a second because it's gonna enter like a story mode screen, so it may, so it's gonna pause the recording, but I'll still be back afterwards. So you'll see me soon. So, oh, and also you get to pick, um, if you've like played a few Sonic games and you know how everything's going, um, then um, you could choose hard mode, but if you never played this game or nothing, you should pick normal mode. So I'm gonna pick normal. Okay guys, I have exited the, um, I have exited the, I have exited the story screen, so it paused for a second, but now I'm back. It says, hint, as long as you have at least one thing, at least one ring, you'll survive when you take damage. Okay, so we need to get these gold rings. All you need to do is move forward. All you need to do is move forward, try to get rings, and do it with uh, the left joystick to move forward. This is only the first stage that I'm doing. Okay, whenever you call across that question mark, it get, tells you stuff. Picking up a wisp cap, so we'll add to the boost thing. This, that thing I just ran over was a wisp, was a wisp one, and um, those help uh, do this. Oh, and also, if you guys want to go super fast, this is what you do. You just hold down um, square. And then you need to press X to jump. Boop, boop. And in order to attack, you need to jump. And if there's like a... Or if you just see an enemy, like an enemy robot, if there's like a green thing on them, like here, I'm gonna come over to this guy. He's not green, but see how, you, see how they're going green? If they're going green, then that means that they are an enemy. But also you could just jump right into them too. Man, look at the size of that thing. So those green robots are enemies, and you can just jump and then press X on them when they're green, and it'll just shoot you right at them. See? When I jump, they're green, and when I press X, I shoot at them. And we don't need to go there. What we could do is go over here. Do you guys see that little stick thing? Jump on it. We got another wisp capsule. And boost. There's sand everywhere. Green Hill's looking a lot more like Sand Hill right now. And then you, even and then the max coins you could get is a hundred. And um if even if you do get a hundred could still like get extra coins and it adds to your score. Thanks, Eggman. One of my favorite spots is all ruined. Now just boost around. This is it for Green Hill. And you just need to hold down square if you want to keep on boosting. But also this is how you slide. You want to go forward using the left joystick and then hold down circle and then you slide. Whenever you come across something that looks like that, and or if it looks similar, then that's what you have to do. And then there's different ranks on how you did. I did a, I got a B rank. A B rank isn't too good. The best rank you could get is an S, but I was kind of slacking off there, so that way I could go slow, take my time, and show you guys. 
but um yeah and that's it guys um hope you hope this helped and i'll see you next time